All right, guys, welcome back to another Spectre TV video here. This is going to be our mowing series. We're continuing. We haven't done a mowing Monday, and I'm posting this not even on a Monday, on Wednesday. So that's, I guess you can't really consider it mowing Monday, but a lot of people have been asking for it. So here we go, boys. What the plan is, I guess we're taking off from our usual spot. This is the, this is the mowing map made by Square2448 version 1. So it won't have the interstate, and it won't have a few of the... Of the ponds and stuff that version 3 have or has so oh well we'll, we'll keep it keep it uh keep it in the old style on our we actually need to mow our lawn too that's a problem that we need to get done and yeah there we go perfect we are heading over we have a big surprise for you guys a new addition to our special tv mowing it's not how fast you mow it's how well you mow fast line up here we go, guys. We're pulling into the shop. All right, guys. Here it is. The Husqvarna lawnmower. There we go, guys. It's not the biggest lawnmower at all. And it really it isn't too practical, you could say, for what we're trying to do in terms of efficiency and trying to make a business. But there we go. Husqvarna riding lawnmower. It, ha it actually has a bag around the back, too. So that's kind of nice. Um, and then I'm not really sure... I haven't seen this on a mower. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe maybe it's a deta attachment, but to me it looks like just almost like a bumper for a mower. It, it's it's kind of throwing me off, guys. But there we go. Let's start her up. It looks like top speed is nine. Here, let's make sure you guys can hear it. Uh, boom, boom. Let's go to turn her up just a bit. I can't turn her up too much. The Spectre TV High Country is just too loud. But there we go, guys. Husqvarna Rider Lawnmower. I wanted to get... I wanted to get something different in 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 our fleet, in our mowing fleet, and we, we this is this is something very different. Also, we have uh, oh, this is X mark zero turn, and I believe it's kind of like more of the finish cut. I believe that's what they call it, and kind of for like golf courses and more 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 professional lawns, you can say. So we'll be taking that out as well. It's not my favorite mod, but guys, the Husqvarna, look at how tiny it is. Oh my, I can't get over the fact how tiny it is. It just seems like like the wheels and everything I, I don't know it just seems super tiny i really wonder what here let's actually cut some grass with it real quick before we go out and actually do a job oh oh wait oh wait this is awesome guys it it can cut way wider oh wait and the bagger works okay so let's turn the blade off no way it actually can unload okay this for testing purposes guys i know that's super unrealistic i obviously would not dump it right here but just for testing purposes i want to see does it come out as a bale does it come out oh my goodness that is so cool guys i didn't know this going into this video I, it, i'm this is some raw footage boys we haven't even tried this mod out let me know if you guys like the mod by smash the like button in this video again if you guys smash the like button it does help support the channel and it helps this video get more views and we grow so again if you guys would do that we would appreciate it here on the Spectre tv channel all right let's get the the t30i i believe it looks like that okay guys if you see in the top left hand can last top left hand corner of the screen in the control panel it says turn off and then turn on Walker T30i. So is this a Walker or an X mark? Comment section, please let me know. And this one also mows more than the than the width of of the actual mod, the the blade. So that's super nice. We can get extra grass that we that we really shouldn't be getting, and it'll be we'll be a little faster. So kind of a a oddball setup we have here. We don't have a deer. We don't have a Walker. We don't. I guess. I guess I don't even know. Is this an X mark? Is it a walker? Let me know. There's no branding on it, and it's saying two different things, so I don't know. All right, let's fold up the ramps. There we go, boys. We have two residentials and one commercial today. We're going to the commercial first, and there we are, boys. The Spectre TV High Country, we just got an oil change on it, and it seems like everything is going just fine. Just an annual checkup, which is cool, which is cool. All right. Oh, it looks like we should... Ah, oh, I wish I... The guys, the Eager Beaver trailer is absolutely awesome. We've been using it for some time now here on the mowing series. But one thing I don't like is it doesn't lock the load, but no big deal. No big deal at all. All right, we'll hang it right here. I believe it's right... Oh, no. I think I missed my turn. I was too busy showing you guys how the trailer was doing. Okay, 
I did miss my turn. We're gonna have to take another red after this and get back down on the on kind of the retail side of town. There we go, guys. I will see you when we arrive. All right, guys. There we are. We just arrived into Tractor Supply, and they. Okay, perfect, perfect. I honestly, I feel like honestly, like one of the workers. It might be smarter if they just grab one of their new mowers that they have in mow like themselves. I don't know, but hey, I'm not. I'm not complaining, boys. We're getting an extra account in today. Like I feel like. I don't know people who work at track supply would be like really like oh yeah i'll go mow the lawn for an extra you know like two bucks an hour or whatever on to what they already get okay anyway there we go boys let's crank this over oh okay let's get the husqvarna first get the husqvarna let's what am i gonna do when it's full because i don't have anything how am i gonna what am i gonna do with the extra grass i really really have no clue what i'm gonna do with the extra grass whatsoever i love how it mows so much boys it mows so much all right let's crank it over it's kind of like the walker mower where it, it it mows way more than it actually looks like it's supposed to which is yeah which is again like super nice makes it things go a little faster because i was a little worried about that guys we're already getting full we're already at 46 percent. no this is not good this is not good what am I going to do with the grass? I should have got... Uh, we need to figure this out. Guys, we're going to make another video officially, like, bagging a uh, um, a lawn. I think we'll do, like, an official bagging mowing lawn video, which will be pretty cool. And we can get a super efficient system down. I feel like that will be the best. All right, first person view in the Husqvarna. Pretty decent, pretty good. I haven't... I don't even think I've used the rider. No, I haven't. I haven't used the rider. I have used mods that have baggers on them, but none that actually work. So, does it quit mowing? No. It doesn't quit mowing. It keeps going, but I guess... Are we leaving any grass behind? No. So, it's still picking it up, but it's not actually picking it up. That is kind of nice. That's actually, like, super nice. So, we won't make a mess if we accidentally, like, go over, like, an extra foot. Um, and we can still use it without having to unload. Which is big because I have nothing to unload it with. Well, we'll have to figure out a good way to do this because obviously in this game you can't pick up grass. Like, how am I going to do it? Maybe we'll have a skid loader and a bucket and bring a trailer, but I feel like that's so much extra. Guys, go in the comment section. Let me know what the setup should be. Obviously, we can't have like little bags. You know, you put them in bags on. Uh, dang, I don't know. We'll see, guys. Let me know what I should do if we want to do a bailing or not a bailing, a bailing video. What? No, if we want to do a bagging video of mowing, let me know what our setup should be. I'm kind of curious if anybody has any good ideas. And obviously, in terms of what we can do on Farming Simulator, is limited to real life. So don't be like, yo, Spencer TV, throw it in a bag, put it in the back of your truck. No, we can't, can't do that. Um, let me know. Oh, did I just turn the blade off? There we go. All right, let's hop in the Walker slash X Mart. I still need to. I still don't know exactly what we're driving here, but it's cool. It's a finished mower, something kind of unique. Today must be unique mowing day. I like our new setup. It's kind of cool. We'll have to take it back to the shop at the end and clean them up a little. There we go, boys. So tractor supply here. We're obviously you see that we're doing this front little lot, and then on the side there. And uh, we're going to finish up this side as well, uh, as far as it goes to the fence. And then, like I said, we do have two residentials. Track sub supply, boys. They're looking a little... Nobody's in... What is this? Nobody's even... I, I Honestly, I think they're closed. I think it's a Sunday. All right. There we go. It looks like it's getting a lot to the right, but not to the left. So I have to, to keep that in mind. And there we go. Let's crank this around. We'll go up to the road, finish off this little square here by the trees in a quick little time lapse. And I'll see you boys when we're done. Alright, there we go guys, finish up that part. And it looks super clean, i.e. 
this mower isn't a bagger, but it is, it's not leaving a trail. So I really like when mowers don't leave a, a, a trail of grass. It, it really makes the finish clean and really, really gives us a good, good look. All right, we're going to do, we're going to do this side trailer on the eager beaver. Cause I just, I don't know. I want to use it and I feel like that's more practical and, uh, and a little more realistic. So there we go. We have, I wonder what the thousand is. It says we have a thousand of grass, 100% full. I wonder if it can't be leaders. Obviously it can't. I mean, what can it be? Can't, uh, let, oh, don't go over. Can't be like, obviously it can't be tons. It can't be, can't be pounds. I don't know what it would be. What the measuring scale would be uh, that it's telling us that we have a thousand of something. Okay. Anyway, enough talking. Let's head over to the residential. It's actually fairly close. It was actually where we where we went off course or where we weren't supposed to be. Right, there we go. We can take away the map. It's on the other side of town. We're going to knock that out real quick. And then we have one more. But, guys, let me know what you think. Oh, what? I was just about to say, let me know what you think of the Husqvarna. And it's gone. What the heck? Okay, guys. Oh, okay. This isn't good. We brand new mower. Honestly, it doesn't look that new. Like, it's not that shiny. But I wonder when did this... Okay, this had to have happened on the turn. That is so funny. Oh, my goodness. All right. Let's see if we can pick it right back up. And there we go. Awesome, awesome. Is it... It's not even... Okay, so it turned off, too. Maybe I had it turned off. But why did it fall off there? But I drove the same speed getting here. I don't know. We're going to have to keep... Oh, not that button. We're going to have to keep an eye on it. All right, let's crank this around. Oh, no, 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 no. I wonder. All right, let's watch it. Stay in there, boy. Oh, this is throwing me off. I don't know. We'll have to be careful on the turns. I'll keep my view. I'll scroll out a little so we can always watch it. I don't see it moving yet. All right, break in. All right, it's, it kind of twitched there, but so does so does the the other rider, the green machine. All right, perfect. We just made it. Break, break, break. All right, we will unload on the road. Oh, that's nice. See, it's nice. The eager beaver. Like, look at that. Here, let's turn off the truck. Super loud. The truck's so gosh dang loud. Oh, we left we left that mower on oh well short drive there we go crank her over get her started get the blade running honestly not a bad mower at all it looks very small very petite but we still go we can manage nine miles an hour and we can manage a pretty wide cut which is which is really good super happy about that all right there we go boys so we go to the tree line here i always got to remember we have so many residential houses and so many so many places we gotta mow that you gotta remember the property lines because sometimes it's not that clear especially when they mow you know like right next to us so there we go guys we're gonna get the outside and i think what we'll do here ooh, i think we'll time lapse most of it and i will probably or i guess here's some first person of the husqvarna i've already seen that uh crank it around boys we're being pretty profitable with the Spencer TV mowing series business. So if you guys want to see more mowing episodes just like this, new mods, new stuff going on in new lawns, let me know by smashing the like button. Go in the comment section. Tell me, yo, Spence, do some more. Or like, yo, Spence, I found this new awesome mowing mod. Let's do it. And, uh, and I can, yeah, we can make that happen. Perfect. So just another thing to think about. Also, Discord is in the link of this, of the... Is in the, the link is in the description of this video and you what that will get you is yeah you know, first off i go in there about once a day two times a day and and say hi enter some calls stuff like that and i can talk to you guys if you ever want to talk to me there uh and stuff like that and kind of interact with you guys and oh and we have a dedicated server coming up so the best way to get on that if you do want to play with me is the discord because that's where i announce everything and if i'm doing a live stream of like cops and robbers or farming i'm like hey guys i'm doing that and i pretty much anyway it's the best way to get announcements and communicate with me so go make sure to go check that out in the description with that being said let's enter the warp 
of speed and time that is our time lapse. Okay, so so far we've done this whole entire thing with the Husqvarna. It seems like it's doing fine. Like it only totally manages everything. And once again, I I don't know. I guess when we get back to the shop, I can unload this if you guys want to see it and uh, and see exactly how much grass we actually have in there because it filled up so quick, so quick. And I don't know. We'll see. I do want to make a video dedicated specifically to this mower and and bagging it. I guess we can't bag ah, like saying I guess we are bagging it because obviously there's a bag on the end of the mower right there that's bagging it but we aren't putting it in bags after that and like taking it somewhere like you would usually do like sometimes in my my town I don't know how it it is in other places but you can take those bags on um, especially when there's leaves obviously that's why you bag to get rid of the leaves and and you can take them to like recycling plant run by the city it's super cool and it makes your lawn look so nice all right, finishing up a few spots. Oh, I missed that spot. Okay, we got it. We got it. Perfect. And then this back, this spot right here in the back, in the side of the house, kind of backish, will knock this out. And then we have a super duper small residential after this. And then we are done for the day. We're gonna head back to the shop, knock, uh, knock on un unloading everything off the trailer, off the eager Beaver boys. Can't miss this last spot. Can't miss it. We can't do it. There we go. We're only as good as our last shot. There we are. Let's load her up. Beautiful. Lawn looks great, guys. And it looks super good that we don't leave any grass behind as well with our bagger. Oh, don't do that. All right. There we are. Let's shut this while we're here. Shut the back gate, the side gate all at once. Cool. I don't... I've seen very few eager beavers in action in real life. But when I do see them, so cool. There we go, boys. Yeah, I, I upped the sound on the the game, the audio, and I feel like the high country, I don't know how it's going to come out, but it, it seems pretty gosh dang loud. All right. There we go. Last residential is a, is not, is this, it's right by the trailer park, right here, this yellow, small little, little house, kind of, oh, there's the Husqvarna, what the heck? Okay, so... I guess it was when I was turning. It kind of just wobbled off. It's throwing me off, though. I don't know. I should have paid attention. Come on, Switcher TV. Oh, there she goes. All right, let's unload her. We're going to go once around the house with it here. And then I'm thinking kind of just the edges. And then we'll come in with X mark, the big old cutter on that, and a uh, big deck. And we can knock this out. There we go. I like how... They have a space from where they have like a little bit of concrete on the side of their house or dirt there. So the grass doesn't grow like right next to it, which is super nice. Makes this makes this have a lot easier of a job. And then right here on the tree, honestly, I could probably finish this super quick with the Husqvarna, but I'll probably go grab the X mark. I think it's a hair faster. I'd say it's just a bit faster. There we go. So we outlined it with the Husqvarna. We'll turn the blade off shut the engine off go grab this for our last one there we go boys there we go come on big cat fire up i want to get a grasshopper mower that's what i oh what's wrong with it is it how come it's not i wonder some type of collision all right, we got to do something I didn't want to do, but we have to. Oh, it didn't even move it. What? Okay, I feel like this thing was moving when we were driving, and now it doesn't want to get off. Maybe turn on the motor. Okay, all right. We turned the blades on, and that seemed to do it. No big deal. Oh, oh, there we go. Turn the blades back on. 
because that was unsafe. We turned him on on the trailer and knocked this bad boy out, and then that should be it for today's work. And then I did find a weed eater mod. I don't know how it's going to work. I do want to test it out and see if we can get some weed eating done because that is, uh, that would be very cool. So, yeah. There we go, guys. Quick time lapse of this, and we will knock this out lippity, real quick. I just realized that when we have the blade on, we're only going 7 miles an hour. Like, this is substantially slower, but I, for some reason I feel like we have a wider cut. But I wonder if we actually do. Like, obviously, this mower's way bigger than a Husqvarna. But I feel like the deck of the Husqvarna is really cutting a lot more than it should be. Alright, so there we go. We will be heading back to our house. We'll be unloading the Husqvarna. We haven't even put it in the shop yet. We'll see how she looks. I don't think she's going to take up too much space, which obviously I'm not worried about that, which is kind of nice. All right, there we go. Where's she at? There she is, boys. There's the there, there's the football stadium right over there, by the way. Too bad we couldn't mow that. Too bad it's artificial grass. Gosh, dang it, boys. We can mow the baseball field, though. That is something we can do, and I believe we already have once before. I don't know. They didn't call us back. Why is that? Why did they not call us back? All right. There we go. Let's go head back. Break her up. There we go, boys. There we go. And then we will drive right back here. All right. Let's get over. All right. I'm going to pay attention this time. And we're going to see if the Husqvarna actually is coming off on turns or what the heck is happening. There we go. Uh, it didn't move there. Maybe it just all goes at once. If I just come in a little too hot. She, she's, she gets sent. All right, there we go. Perfect. Ours is with the gates or the fence there, which looks super nice, honestly. That fence is really cool. That backyard is awesome. It has a pool. We have a pool, too, our, our, and a hot tub. All right, let's unload this bad boy. Then that is going to be it for today's video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. Again, if you guys want to see more mowing videos like this, let me know by smashing the like button, comment, and doing everything you can. Subscribe if you haven't already. We would appreciate it here. Or, and I would appreciate it if I could get this bad boy off. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like the, like the aerial shot there. That's kind of cool. Anyway, once again, thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Let's get this. Where should we put it? Oh, let's just throw it in right here. And that will be it. Boom. How's she look? Beautiful. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. And I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.